South Africa's parliament has descended into a fist fight as opposition MPs disrupted the annual State of the Nation address by President Jacob Zuma. Mr Zuma twice got to his feet to speak but was shouted down by a left-wing opposition group. The president has been dogged by allegations of corruption and cronyism and widely criticised for his handling of the economy. The uproar broke out just as President Zuma began his address to Parliament. Thank you. <coughs> and the deputy... Red Members of an opposition group interrupted, denouncing him as a scoundrel. Sitting in front of us here, it's a man who is... Are you is on a point of order? An incorrigible man, rotten to the core. The confrontation suddenly descended into an all-out brawl. Dressed in red, the radical economic freedom fighters scuffled with security guards who tried to drag them out of the chamber. Punches were thrown as other MPs watched on. The parliamentary speaker was left powerless to intervene. We see honourable members using their heads to harm others. Until the group were finally expelled. But there was more violence outside where protesters clashed with police. EFF members threw plastic posts, angry that President Zuma had deployed hundreds of soldiers to keep them away. Soon MPs from the main opposition party stormed out of the chamber to join them, denouncing the president as unfit for office. This government is worse than P.W. Porter. Milit bringing the army into this place, the police, and ultimately taking the media away. President Zuma has been dogged by allegations of corruption since he took power eight years ago, but he survived several no-confidence votes and refuses to step down. The next election is due in 2019. Ann Barker, ABC News.